I'm going to talk to you today about how science has changed my understanding of religion. And this comes from um, my studies of educational psychology. One of my professors taught me about positive psychology, and it's a new movement in the field of psychology which uh, started around the year 2000 by Martin Seligman, professor of psychology at the University of Pennsylvania. And he said that psychology lost its way, that for a hundred years it has um, attempted to solve all of the dysfunctions of human behavior. But he said that it really has to get back to what it was originally intended to do, which was to foster the well-being of human beings. And uh, so he engaged, along with his students and many others, to study positive values such as happiness, resiliency, optimism, uh, gratitude, forgiveness, and uh, things like that. So, um, and, and they really did a lot of research and, and really did it in a scientifically valid manner. So these concepts, as they defined them, became uh, reliable and valid. And uh, when I studied this material, um, which included going back to uh, religion and philosophy for 2,000 years, because they wanted to make it a multicultural, universal kind of uh, phenomenon, in saying that that's where psychology was originally oriented. Well, I wanted to go back to uh, the Jewish sources, and, and their sources were, were very meager. So I felt that um, there was a lot of commonality between positive psychology and Judaism. Um, Jewish tradition is uh, very rich in these concepts, not in such a systematic way, but, but because Judaism and Jewish people have experienced so much, Jewish religious literature contains a great deal of information on these topics, on uh, hopefulness, on optimism, on um, gratitude, forgiveness. And a lot of this research shows how important all of these concepts and values are to lead a, uh, an enriching, meaningful, and um, healthy uh, lifestyle. And so um, I've done a great deal of research trying to correlate the findings of positive psychology and Judaism. And it has transformed my whole understanding of our tradition. And I think it's a way that we can uh, really promote Judaism in a positive manner.